Hello, hi Facebook, this is Apostle Deanna Dixon. Um, you have to excuse me, I'm just getting out the shower. It seems as though, you know, God, He really, um, you know, pretty much talks to me, especially when I am in the shower. And I, you know, have to come up on here and actually say what thus saith the Lord, because it's not about, you know, me at all, but it's about his people, especially in this last hour. Um, what you're seeing is that you're seeing the great falling away that was prophesied, that's been in the Bible. Um, there's a lot of God's people that have been compromised from great leaders to small leaders. You know, they don't understand. They want the popularity, they want the fame, they want the money. And it's called the residue. What is a residue spirit? When you want other things more than God and you suppress it and not deal with it. You know, when you have weaknesses, you have to let the Lord thy God know because he already knows. He wants you to know what you're dealing with and to be very um, precise and have clarity about it. A lot of us, we like to pretend that nothing's wrong. Come on, somebody. Being transparent is letting people know, I had this problem or I have this problem. And asking God, God, keep me. Keep me, Lord. You know what I'm dealing with. That's true integrity. That's true honor. And God honors that because he already knows your heart. He already knows how you feel. And a lot of people are allowing their flesh to lead them astray. Your desires to lead you astray. The, you know, the book of James say that you can't blame God and say that God enticed you. It was your own heart. First chapter James. Read that whole chapter. It tells you about being a doer of the word. Be slow to speak, quick to hear, slow to wrath. Come on, somebody. So what you are seeing is the great falling away. Leaders. They have mixed with the world. The enemy has confused them. They started off being righteous, but they wanted something more. Not understanding that once you start compromising, you're always compromising. Because it has to go back to the beginning of that seed, the beginning of that thing. You can always stop it. All you got to do is, you know, God, I repent. I repent, God, and change it. Just change it. You know, you, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta want to change. You can do this. Repentance. Sometimes you have to repent daily, just for thoughts. Come on, somebody, hallelujah to His name. So what you're seeing is the great falling away, especially from the church. People want to do what they want to do. They don't want to be holy anymore. And then have the audacity to get mad at the ones that do want to walk in righteousness. That do want to walk in holiness. And that will say what thus said the Lord says to say. These are not... This is not the time that you want to play. Because judgment has begun in the house of God. And like I stated yesterday in the post... It's getting to the point, you don't have to expose anybody. God will allow them to expose themselves. Case in point, example, Pastor Jamal, the preachers on that show, he exposed his true heart. Whether he was joking or not, people saw the real you and how you felt. And just to be honest with you, him and Pastor John, you disappointed God that day. Because you were supposed to sit there and not worry about a paycheck, ratings, but that was two souls and you should have corrected it right then and there. But this is a form of compromising. We want the fame, we want to be liked. You know, he, he was so worried about, oh, she's from Baltimore, like I am. She has a soul and she's an era. So I pray that you understand and I pray that you do not get weak and get feeble and run after the, the, the things of this world like most are doing, money, cars, fame.
the, the earth is about to be destroyed whether you like it or not so all that stuff is going to be stubble and rubble is it worth it is it worth your soul god forbid so i pray that you hold on pray for those that have strayed in the name of jesus that god can bring them back and they repent of their ways in jesus name this is apostle deanna dixon with the video on the great falling away and how people have compromised and have been compromised and another thing if you're under somebody that has been compromised and you know about it then you are just in error as well because now it's all a facade you're under a facade y'all just faking the funk come on somebody just faking it I, and i hate when people say fake it till you make it no don't fake it till you make it. give me the truth this is my soul i desire truth i don't want to go to hell I'm preparing for heaven. I don't want to prepare for hell. God bless you. This has been Apostle Deanna Dixon. I pray that you have a blessed night. In Jesus' name.